Hi friends. How are you? In this video, we will learn how to mark the nozzle centers on tanks and pressure vessels. Let us have a look at the drawing. Please note that I draw this drawing for teaching purposes only. What is TL and WL? TL stands for tan line and WL stands for weld line. The surface between the TL and the WL is called SF or straight face. Here, the straight face is 50 millimeters. In this drawing, the nozzle center distance is starting from the TL. In some drawings, you may see, the nozzle center is given from the WL, so, before starting the marking, carefully see these things. Look at the nozzle orientation. The nozzle orientation is in anti-clockwise direction. We are going to mark the centers of nozzles, N1, N2, N3, and N4. N1 nozzle comes on 0 degree, N2 on 30 degree, N3 on 40 degree, and N4 on 60 degree. Nozzle, N1 is turned, 25 degree from LSW. As the straight face 50 mm is on the dish end, we need to subtract 50 mm from the overall dimension. Mark the zero degree line. As per the drawing, zero degree is rotated 25 degree anti-clockwise from the center of the weld joint. We have the including degree and the diameter of the tank. Let us calculate the arc length. Arc length for 25 degree is equal to outer diameter into 3.142 divided by 360 into 25 is equal to 545.5 millimeters. Mark this distance on the end of the shell. Mark the same distance, roughly 850 millimeters away from the end of the shell, and draw a line. Now, mark 850 millimeters exactly on this line from the end of the shell as shown. This is the center of the nozzle N1. Extend the nozzle N1 center line up to the other end of the shell and mark it as zero degree. Let us mark the center of nozzle N2. It comes on 30 degree anti-clockwise. Convert 30 degree to arc length. Mark this dimension at two locations as shown and draw a line. Draw an arc of 1350 millimeters from the edge of the shell intersecting this line. This point is the center of the nozzle in two. I suggest you measure the actual circumference of the tank shell instead of calculating using the formal method. Thank you for watching. Good day.